<laughs> Welcome back. Another episode Glazed and Reviewed with me, resident donut king of Southern California, as well as my new guy here, Joe Welk. What's up, everybody? Joe, Thanks for having me, man. show, my man. An honor, a privilege. I'm, I mean, it really is. I've been <laughs> waiting to do this. <laughs> you I've really been, have. I've been commenting on like the last five or six, like, get me on the show. <laughs> and what's this is what makes no sense about it, because if you follow Joe or if you've seen Joe in person, <laughs> you know that he does what I don't do. He practices discipline. <laughs> like, he's shredded aesthetically. He's always doing stuff like... I recently had a serious weight loss, and I was like, the only silver lining is I have a better foundation to attack Joe Welty from. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm going right back in. I used to have mass, that was all I had. I got nothing right now, my man, I apologize. In a minute. The sex therapist right here. The oh, sex yeah. therapist? No, you. No. Oh, well, man, this guy? I would believe it. Is that my new aesthetic? <laughs> sex therapist? <laughs> LA sex guy? therapist? What's the difference between a penis and a vagina? I don't know. What is? I don't know. That's <laughs> every open micer in LA. Yeah. <laughs> Seriously? That guy's on the four o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> so, we haven't really discussed this in person, but you're a Baltimore boy, right? Yeah, Baltimore. Ravens fan? Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking. So, I'm a huge New England fan and. Uh, Stomped you. Yeah. And we just took the number one seed from you. Yeah. Thanks for gifting us uh, home field advantage throughout the playoffs. If we can't beat you, no one can. That's it. It's a wrap. Well, you'll once playoff time comes around, you'll probably something will click. We'll probably Maybe. like our luck. We'll lose to the Colts or something. Yeah. Like we'll lose to the Bills or somebody stupid that like no one ever saw coming. I'm in true Patriot fan form. I'm like, bring the <laughs> back, dude. <laughs> We need to win some games, dude. Can we revive Aaron Hernandez <laughs> <Yeah>. real quick? <laughs> He's got to have a cousin or something. <laughs> He's Latino. There's tons of them. But we're getting, <laughs> we're getting off track. That's why we do this oh, show gosh. basically unprepared. But today we are at Blue Star Donuts. Portland-based, LA now. Uh, gourmet donut concept. They started in 2012. I'm reading this straight from the wall. Uh, if you've watched an episode before, hopefully you saw one with Kellen. In that, we joked about brioche donuts. Oh, baby. Brioche donuts. So, we came in. They were super cool. We went with their OG Oaxaca glaze or horchata or something. But it looks awesome. I'm pumped to try this. Yeah, it smells really good. I mean, it's got a really nice aesthetic inside. It's a good looking spot. Yeah, it looks very Silver Lake LA. Yup. Yep. And their enthusiasm for what we're doing was awesome, so I'm all about that. But uh, let's dive in, right? Shall we? Donut cheers, dink. Blue <laughs> Star, OG Glazed. What is that? I don't know, they found lemony. I'm getting like alcohol or something? like. Do you get like apple cider almost? Yeah, it's some kind of fruitiness to it. But I wouldn't know alcohol because I've never drank a melon. <laughs> That's right. No, I want to talk about that. Like, you, I, I joke about discipline. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, so I'm the least degenerate person I know. I'm going to get in league with basically a collection of LA's biggest degenerates and do comedy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what are you thinking? Dude, I've just been in league with the worst people ever. I started, Baltimore. I started doing comedy when I was 18, and you know, com comedians are just the worst human beings ever. Uh, but I just had never drank at that point, and it was mainly like a high school thing where people were like, "No, you gotta drink." Yeah. And that's when I was just like, "Fuck you, I don't gotta do it." Hence the rules. So. Yeah. I was, fuck you, I don't yeah, gotta do it. You know, I beat, beat my own drum or whatever that shit was. And meanwhile, I'm like, sure, let's drink. Every night. <laughs> and <Fuck>. day. Yeah. <laughs> I literally was like, we passed a place on the way here that's called 33 Taps. And I was like, do I have to go to the gym? <laughs> I knew you didn't drink. I did not know that you have never drunk. Never, never, ever. So Never smoked either? Nope. Which is funny because whenever I'm like in a movie 
like whenever not that I'm like a movie star or some shit but uh, my friends will like write a part for me in their movie and they'll be like I got a part for you and I'm always a stoner or drunk or a crackhead it's like I've never done any of that shit He's so not a movie star that when he said, whenever I'm in a movie, I was like, oh, he likes going to the movies. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and then he says, not like I'm a movie star, and I'm like, oh, he means in, in movies. movies. God, yeah, Sean. God. <laughs> Sorry. Fuck you. <laughs> Piece of shit. I love it. All right, so this is a weird donut. Yeah. I'm with you. It doesn't... It's, it's it, good. It's not like a glazed donut regular. It tastes better on the tail than it does on the nose for me. Uh -huh. Like, the first bite's not great, and then the flavor it leaves afterward is pretty fucking good. On the tail and the nose? Yeah, the nose is the... Huh? And the tail is the... Huh? <laughs> is this wine terminology? It is! is. <laughs> I'm bougie like that. That's why we're here. It is kind of citrusy. Yeah, yeah. It's for sure like an apple. It's got like orange, lemony. I mean, I love it. It's great. It's not a typical glaze whatsoever, so it's hard to kind of give it that rating. Yeah. Well, what do you give? One of five. I give it a four. Wow, that's pretty dope. I'm pretty you hot. don't even finish it? No. Dude, I'm finishing this. All right, he says four. Glaze. I'm just annoyed that you didn't eat the whole thing. Three, two. See, the, the, the critic here. Here we go. All right. Nice. Now, Mr. Welke choose, chose maple glaze. Maple, maple bacon. bacon. What am I, high? Yes. <laughs> but <laughs> that's not the point. Why maple bacon? Always been your thing? I, it's never been my thing, except for once I moved out here. I'd never seen one before, and I went to, I think it was SK. I think we did an episode about SK yep. in, uh, in downtown, like not downtown, like mid Wilshire, LA. Yeah. Saw it, love bacon, love donuts. Saw it, love bacon. <laughs> and I was like, let me try it. I've never done like this sweet and savory thing. I've had like a bacon vanilla ice cream cookie before. See, usually I'm typically not a huge fan of them. I don't, I don't like maple. And I also am not huge on uh, savory and sweet simultaneously. Uh -huh. But I've had a couple that are good. You know, all the Canadian young bucks go bananas every time we get a fucking maple bacon. Dude, you know who has terrible maple bacon? <laughs> Voodoo Donuts in in uh, Universal. Voodoo Donuts, step up your fucking maple bacon game. It's terrible. It's trash. If you watch the show, that's the second guest that has trashed Voodoo Donuts. <laughs> Hopefully Voodoo isn't watching the show yet. No, but... no, Voodoo is good. Their maple bacon's bad. Like, I went to Voodoo in Denver for the first time. That's where I've been, yeah. That's yeah. the only it one was, I've been to. It was good in Denver, and then I got... The, like a regular donut and a maple bacon. The They're kind of too fine. much for me, even then. They, like, I like this. This is like a refined classic. Yeah. You know what I mean? They it's have bougie, dope, but. Dope merch, though. They really do. Dope merch. Because it's a huge culture. Right? They know how to market themselves. They do a good job. All right. Are we doing this? Donut cheers. Boom. Maple bacon. Hmm. The maple is almost like made from the bacon fat. As I say, this is a little too smoky for me. Still better than Voodoo. <laughs> but this is, I still enjoy this. It's very smoky. Wow, this is so much for my palate. <laughs> I feel like I'm biting off a fucking ham hock, dude. It's so bacon. Yeah, it's very bacon. -y. It's not even that much maple. I think I get more maple in the tail. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> pretentious piece of shit. <laughs> Nailed that. <laughs> now the first bite, the first like taste is a lot more bacony. And it's very smoky to me. And then it gets a little sweeter as I keep chewing. But I still dig it, man. I'm I'm loving it. Wow. Go, John. <laughs> it's such a weird sensation. Have you ever felt your blood get thin from the amount of sugar you ingested? But then you start feeling like you're gonna get meat sweats at the same time? All I can taste is bacon. It's a maple bacon donut. Yeah. Like, I. I it is heavy on the bacon, I'll give you Yeah, that. it's heavy, heavy on the bacon, which, I mean, 
you'd think I would be like, they nailed it. Uh, but I don't know. If you like maple bacon, you're probably gonna really like this. Yeah. If you're more, if you've ever been eating a maple bacon donut and been like, man, I wish it tasted almost exclusively like bacon, <laughs> then you will fucking love this donut. <laughs> You will write home about this donut if you do that, man. All right, one to five. Polished? Yeah. Joe doesn't fuck around. Dude, I'm about to eat your maple bacon. I gotta hit the <laughs> rings, apparently, dude. God damn. One to five. I'm gonna give it a 3.8. 3.8. 3.8, just because it wasn't as, like you were saying, like it's not balanced well. Like it's very, very bacony. Like yeah. I, there's a little bit of the maple, but the bacon is really much at the forefront of the taste. But I still like it. He's still, right. Yeah. I, but he's also wrong. Um, <laughs> go, I'm going to go 2-8. Wow. Yeah. Harsh, man. I mean, because it's pretty good, but it's not enough maple for me. Like, I needed a little more maple. The bacon, man. Very bacon. -y. It's rich, but it's pretty good. Now, the question is, is do we just roll straight in, I'm or down. do we try and break this in two? I'm down to roll straight in, I don't care. I, dude, I'm housing these. <laughs> he is housing these! Should we uh, go Here grab we that? Go.